Hi everyone, welcome back to Champagne Strokes. Brought to you by me, Champagne Killer. So I took a little drag break. I really needed some time to educate myself on the Black Lives Matter movement, systematic racism and white supremacy because this country is not listening. So with that being said, I'm gonna bring you a gorgeous painting of one of my favorite authors, James Baldwin. Born in Harlem in 1924, he is an American author, playwright, activist, and poet. James Baldwin's literary works explore race, sexuality, and class. And if you have been on Netflix recently, this one. A vital part of the civil rights movement in the 1960s and tragically died in Paris, France in 1987. His writing style is so personal and poetic, I felt romance and cathartic. With that being said, let's get into this painting. The first layer looks pretty good. I sketched it all out with a graphite pencil, then I went in with light blues to add the shadows and then warms right on top of all that. Adding detail along the way, uh, much of painting is losing and finding. And if you don't have that balance, it's not gonna feel alive. But for right now, it looks pretty good. A good solid layer. I'm gonna let that dry for just a second and then jump back in there and add my bright. Who wants to see the final look? Wow. As you can see, portraiture is um, really difficult, but with only an hour into this painting, I like what I got. He was pretty much always in a suit and tie and like all poets, smoking a cig. So I added that for likeness, but I don't encourage the habit. So one way to make all of your artworks feel balanced is to add the darkest color to the bottom so that way it really grounds you in. Hope you learned a little bit about art and a lot about James Baldwin. Make sure that you continue to stand up for black people and people of color everywhere. One final note, make sure that if you like this video, you like and subscribe. Until then, stay sane, stay healthy, and keep up the good fight with love. Champagne killer. Bye.